Hello, and I'm back with a new tutorial about removing new adware called BetaBrain. Uh, this adware shows ads in uh, major browsers, Internet Explorer, uh, Google Chrome, and Mozilla Firefox, and it is installed as extensions in these browsers. Ads usually look like this uh, on various shopping sites, it may vary, but it's quite annoying, uh, slows down your internet browsing. And in this video, I will show you a step by step tutorial on how to remove it. Uh, of course, maybe you've already done some steps I will show, but uh, make sure, double check if you've done them all, because I will show everything from the very beginning. So, first thing you need to do, I'm using Windows 8, but uh, pretty much uh, instructions are the same uh, for other systems. Uh, in my Google Chrome, however, BetaBrain was not installed. As you can see, I go to Settings, Extensions, BetaBrain is not installed, but I will show you instructions for Chrome also. So, first thing you need to do is to close your browsers. Go to Add Remove Programs or Programs and Features. In Windows 8, I can go there by one click. But I will show you how to get there from control panel. Uh, here is icon view. You just need to click programs and features. Or in category view, just click on install a program. If you have a lot of programs as usual uh, installed, you can sort them by date and remove uh, last programs you don't know anything about. Uh, that this can be, can be not only better brain, but some other stuff. Uh, in my case, this is Better Brain, and I will remove Better Brain version 1.10.0.2. I will run the standard uninstaller. In some cases, this already may help. And this, uh, for example, in my case, it removed all extensions, and uh, uh, Better Brain ad disappeared from the browsers. However, uh, there are some cases where Better Brain. Uh, continues to reappear after you restart Google Chrome, restart the computer and I will show you how to deal with it. So let's check uh, in Firefox. You can see this removed, but if it is not removed, just click remove button in front of, uh, to the right from the name of the extension. And close the tab. Well, uh, as usual, I've tested uh, three major programs uh, that are that can remove uh, bad brain. Uh, the first one and the leading one is PyHunter. It removed 120 infections, all folders, all register keys, all files. Uh, so, but the brain will be completely removed from the computer. Then, second program is uh, Stronghold Anti Malware. It detected uh, nearly all files uh, and register keys, all main register keys and uh, files will be removed by this application. And the third one uh, is one of the most famous small malware by Centralware. It showed the least uh, detection, however, uh, it can also help you remove persistent module of better brain in case continue to reappear uh, in your browsers. Uh, they call it better buy. Uh, so what will I do? I just uh, click apply actions uh, to make sure my web rights remove this infection uh, and we'll do the same in other programs. Fix now. Yep. The matter is that uh, sometimes um, just simple uninstall will not help and you need to use special tools um, to, sh to find persistent module that continue to install this extension in your browsers and in some cases manual way is just impossible. In the end of the video I will show you a ton of way. You need to restart your computer. And uh, all links to all these software will be in the description. They are easy to download and install. 
I will show you one tip how you can fight uh, advertising extensions using Avast browser cleanup. It is free utility. It is part of Avast antivirus. But in case you don't have uh, Avast antivirus, you just can download and install uh, utility. Uh, it's just three megabytes in size. So you go to avs.com slash store and you go down, scroll down, click on browser avs browser cleanup and you download this file. As I as I said, maybe you're already aware of this tool, maybe you already used it. But in my cases this helps uh, in many cases removing advertising extensions and resetting, restoring browser settings. So I will paste it on the desktop and run it as administrator. Yes, so it will start analyzing our browsers, but we already have removed all the stuff, so it will not find anything, just Explorer VNB Helper, which is a part of iobeta installer. So using this utility, just uh, going from tab to tab, from the Explorer to Google Chrome, you can not only remove extension, uh, but also reset your settings in case your search settings, the homepage settings uh, were changed. Goodbye.